Hey, good afternoon, TCA family. Thank you guys so much for joining us. In today's video, we got something special for you guys. You're going to be learning the benefit of having a system when you're talking about acquiring properties. Yeah, and we're going to open up our system, our whole acquisition system, all of the software that we use, all the process that we processes that we use to actually find and acquire uh, properties and mobile homes when we're looking to flip them. But y'all know what to do. Mm -hmm. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Also hit the like button if you get value out of this video or if you've gotten any value out of the videos that we've been showing you guys in this particular series. So excited to get into it. Let's go ahead and get into it now. I want to give you guys first a reminder, just a refresher of where we've been up to this point and where we're going with scale your sale so we've already gone through uh, section one which is your business foundations we've also gone through advanced marketing last uh last week and this week we're focused on acquisitions and dispositions next week we'll be focusing on people and then the week after that we'll be wrapping it up with operations and finance and we also want to know if you're a student if you're getting value let us know below. Yeah. And so for those of you guys that are brand new to the channel, we are launching our Scale Your Sales program. We're in the middle of it. And basically, this program is if you've done at least three deals, we want to show you how to really scale mm -hmm. your business and take it to the next level. So we're going through each of the modules each week. We're releasing a whole section in the accelerator program. So make sure that you guys are watching it and making sure that you guys are ready to, to get to work because this yeah. is really how you're going to scale to that six figure and beyond mark. Yeah. Again, all this information is free if you're a student, but if you're brand new, if you just got into the program, really just focus on um, the original accelerator program get through all your modules make sure you write down any questions you have get on the coaching calls and just take it nice and slow once you've gotten that second that third deal really once you got about that third deal done that's when you're ready to really scale your business up and these modules will be waiting on you guys for the rest of you guys that have done at least those three deals let's keep it going let's just hop right into it absolutely so in this section we're talking about the acquisitions process and these are some of the things that you want to think about some of the questions you want to be asking yourself if you're at that three deal mark. all about raising that awareness up yeah. so the first question is what is your process for handling incoming calls and what happens if you can't answer the call line man i know how it is to be in the field you're doing different things maybe you're working maybe you're in school and you can't answer the call but sometimes when you miss that one call sometimes those are the best deals and you might end up losing it because they go and find your competitor and your competitor beats you to the money yeah and if you have no systems you're always on edge i remember yeah. every time the phone rang we were oh, running to the phone like this could be money we can't we can't miss a call For real. you're not screening your calls yeah. so a lot of wasted time there yep. um another question you want to ask is how are you organizing your client information and data i can tell you how i was doing it at first i was putting everything on the closest envelope or piece of paper <laughs> i could find or uh keeping a lot of the stuff in my head and i i say that i'm completely transparent because i know some of y'all out there <laughs> doing the same maybe not as worse as me but your organization skills are just not where they need to be or should be yeah. in terms of like being an actual ceo yeah and we want to pull that mm -hmm. information from papers everywhere mm -hmm. and in your head to something digital that you can the whole team can see at once it can mm -hmm. be uh, you know updated in real time so this is important think about where is this information and is it safe that's mm -hmm. another question you want to think about. And the last question is, are you managing your own follow-up and appointment uh, pipeline? So mm -hmm. when you're calling your clients, following up with them, scheduling walkthroughs on their properties, are you doing all the work yourself or do you have help? Do you have systems and processes in place so that they can do some of the work for you? Start thinking about these things because that can really drain you. <laughs> so now that we've actually raised the awareness, we've asked ourselves these questions, we can now go into the seven benefits you will get if you implement business systems in your company right now as it pertains to your acquisitions process so let's go ahead and get into number one which is your company will meet and surpass all customer expectations samir how is this so yeah because you're going to really understand your customers wants and needs because you have everything in one place mm -hmm. you can communicate with them a lot faster um they you're be able to exceed the expectations by just really understanding them better and being able to communicate yeah and a lot of the time uh, the clients that we worked with they've never worked with a mobile home investor that actually has like systems and processes mm -hmm. and automations all set up so a lot of the time they're kind of like 
scary because they're like, man, this is all happening so fast. I'm not used to this level of service. Mm -hmm. This is crazy. What's going on here? How are you guys so good? You're going to mm -hmm. blow your customers minds with a lot of these automations and systems you're going to be setting up here soon. Yeah. Number two is your company will produce the same quality results every time. So this is all about consistency. Mm -hmm. And when you have software and other um, automations and things working on your behalf, it's so much easier to produce the same expectations, the same results over and over and over again, because you're not responsible to do it. If you're responsible to contact every client, answer every phone call, there's no way that the results will be consistent. For sure. And with that consistency, once you go and find the right people, which we'll be talking about next week, you will improve employees performance. Again, we're doing the same thing each and every time. So um, when there are any type of leaks throughout your system, any type of bottlenecks throughout your system, you're going to be able to identify them really, really quick. You and your, your team are going to be able to talk about those things, fix those things right there on the spot, and then get back to making the money. And it's going to help <laughs> you guys out so much with your communication and overall efficiency within your business. Yeah, when you, everyone, all your employees, your whole team can be on the same page, can see what's going on with each client as it goes mm. through your pipelines. It just makes the whole team work better. Yeah, so sure. that's a huge benefit. Another benefit is your company will reduce costs. So initially, you're going to have to spend a little bit more to get the softwares and mm. get all of the things that you need in place to create your system. But once that thing is going, you're going to reduce costs so much because the communication and the time that you're spending is going to shrink down and you're going to be able to save on a lot of money because you're going to have a system working for you. Not to mention your effort and energy costs are <laughs> yeah. going to uh, drop. You're going to uh, have actual more energy within your business, but you're going to be saving a ton, saving a ton just by making sure you have the right processes in place. Yeah. Number five is your company will become more organized. And who doesn't want to be more <laughs> organized? That's a huge, huge benefit, especially when we're talking about client data, when we're talking about communicating with the team, all of that is really important. And we want to make sure that we have a process to track our clients. We're not putting things on sticky notes. We're not putting things in random notebooks. We actually know where all of the client information can be found. Yeah. And when you're bringing other people into the organization, I think it makes it a lot easier when everybody's on the same page. When you're actually writing out these systems and processes, everybody can see these things. It's black and white. Nobody's guessing. It makes that employee that you bring into your company feel like you got your stuff together. Feels like they want to stay there with you a while longer um, than just coming and going. You know, it's just it's a lot easier, a lot smoother when you got everything laid out. Number six is your business will solve all problems on a consistent basis. Again, guys, when you have the systems, it's all about consistency. And now you're not just working in your business, looking at all the clients, you're actually working on your business to make sure that the machine that we're building is running efficiently and well. And lastly, number seven is your company will increase profitability, which is what we always want because you're faster you're you're better you're able to communicate with the team so you're able to do more and more deals a lot easier with less effort which is going to increase that bottom line <laughs> so what we want to do is share with you guys our actual system process that we use but um, before we do that uh let us know if you're ready for all that information we want to know comment you know i'm ready also comment where you're from it's the easiest way to start networking right now where you're at. Also, um, if you're ready to become a student with TCA, you can go ahead and apply uh, at the link below. Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to get into just a sneak peek of the module that we're, we're releasing, mm -hmm. module three, the acquisitions and dispositions module, where we're actually going to show you an overview of our acquisition systems mm -hmm. and how we were able to put this all together. So here we go. We want to do, we like giving you guys a bird's eye view of the entire process. So what we want to do is just talk about the entire acquisitions process, because I think this is pretty important when you have people coming in, you got to have this laid out. They need to see this so they know exactly what their role and responsibility is and then where they fit in your process. So first and foremost, we love CallRail. We use CallRail to track our marketing success. Um, we record our calls with our clients and then um, forwards to our answering service. 
And then um, it's our virtual assistant call system. Yeah, so call rail is a, a system. We're going to go into a demo on exactly what that looks like and how we use it. But tracking is important. We've already said that many times. This helps us not have to track every single call manually. It gives us a ton of data. We love call rail. Um, from call rail, we actually forward our calls, our incoming marketing calls to Pat Live. This is our 24 hour answering service. They help us qualify our leads and then they enter the client information into our CRM. We give them a form and we'll go into that too. And the cool thing about Pat Live is they can also um, take your, uh, your, like your Spanish written scripts. So they do English and Spanish. And then how much did we pay for Pat Live when we first started? I think it was around $300 a month. Um, the thing is they do charge per minute. So just know the longer your script is, the more you have talkative people, the more you're going to be charged. Even the more leads that come in, the price can go up. We've paid upwards of $1,000 some months for Pat Live. Um, but for us, it was worth it because we're, get, if we're paying more for Pat Live. That means we're getting more we're leads. Getting more leads. So um, as they enter the client info into the CRM, our CRM that we like to use is Active Campaign. Really, really good, really solid, organizes clients um, info into the pipeline. Um, delegates roles and responsibilities um, for all of the people within our organization that are using our CRM, automates our emails and texts, and then assigns tasks for follow-ups. This is really big, man, because you can write things down. You can try to write things down in your calendar, you know, but chances are you're just going to forget things. We're all human, but I, I love it that Active Campaign kind of keeps it in one place and gives you those alerts. You can set it and forget it. Yeah. And if you have a team, you have to have a central location for you guys all to communicate on what's going on with your clients. If you're trying to do it here in this spreadsheet and here over here, it gets really complicated. So this gives you that centralized location. Next, um, our virtual assistant, this is where they pick things up. Once our leads hit Active Campaign, they actually contact the most qualified leads. They actually set appointments for our inspections so that we don't have to do that. Um, and then they follow up with the lead that don't answer or that go to voicemail. They manage our pipeline so that all the leads that are coming in, they're moving them along the pipeline. We're going to show you guys our pipeline, give you guys um, uh, the whole breakdown of that. And they also confirm appointments. That takes time from us. We want to make sure that we're only going to appointments and inspections that are with serious sellers. And I will say this, when we first started off, we hired um, one assistant for the acquisitions and the disposition side, but we ran into some problems where it was just too much work, especially at our, some of our busiest times. It's going to be very helpful if you can split it up, you know, um, hire an admin for your acquisition side and then one for your disposition side. Yeah, and we'll go into that and exactly how we were able to do that. And lastly, what happens is when they find a qualified lead, they set the inspection and they use Calendly, which is our inspection scheduling tool to actually put it on our calendar or our salesperson's calendar. And then all you have to do, because all of this is automated, all you're doing is checking your calendar. What's What inspections do I have today, tomorrow? And then you can go in, review the leads and make sure that they're qualified. And it makes it takes a lot of the work off your plate when you put this system in place. Yeah, and your your, your salespeople, you yeah. know, whoever's your, your, um, your closing coordinators, whoever those people are, you know, it, it's really great when you don't have to micromanage them. You can just tap into the calendar whenever you need to see what's going on, see who's fulfilled appointments, what appointments got canceled. It makes life really, really easy. Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're actually cool. And we're back. <laughs> so we hope you guys got some value um, out of that. Let's take a quick moment right now. Give you guys a chance to catch up on your notes. <laughs> we got a little bit more for you guys. Absolutely. And so the whole point of this is we're just thinking about saving you time, mm -hmm. becoming more efficient building a team so that they can support you and your goals. And so having these processes and systems and having all of those softwares and in, in place is really going to help you to be able to do that. And we're not saying our system is going to work for everybody. We're not saying our system um, is the best. We're not coming across as know-it-alls. We're just trying to come and say, hey, this has worked for us. We're trying to raise the awareness up a little bit for you guys and hope that you guys take pieces or maybe all of this and just try some things out, test some things out within your business, see what works, see what doesn't. But the whole thing is we want to raise you guys up to become CEOs and uh, make a bigger impact in your community. Yeah. And our most successful students and coaches, they're just, you know, not every, every business is going to look different. Their needs, their yeah. demands, their clients, everything looks different. So mm -hmm. just take what you need, Yeah, you know? 
take the gold, throw out the dirt, and it'll it'll be able to compound on each so other. So if, if there's mobile home investors out there right now that aren't necessarily implementing any of these things, let's kind of take a look where their time is going right now. Yeah. So if and this is just the acquisitions mm -hmm. process. Mm -hmm. If they have no systems, no processes, no other people involved. The investor's time is going a lot to answering the call. That's where our time is going. Let's just be, let's just be real. We're yeah, going to be transparent. Yeah, this is our time. Investors, yeah. when we were uh, you know, just getting started, we were answering a lot of calls. We were scheduling appointments. We were following up on those calls because, hey, we all know the gold is in the follow-up. Yeah. So if you're not following up, you're missing a huge opportunity there. And then organizing client data was a big portion mm -hmm. of it because everything was everywhere we yeah. had nowhere to, we were trying to put them in spreadsheets we were trying to figure out who calls what what is going on i think on. that's what took the most time you trying to interpret my notes <laughs> <laughs> what everything meant <laughs> i'm like who is this what house do they have where is the house located so all over the place your time is really spread thin and this is just to find the properties nonetheless actually acquire them and sell them so a lot of frustration can happen here because you're doing everything yourself. You're, it's, it's hard to stay organized if you don't have a system. The great thing about having Pat Live and having the CRM is they do a lot of the work for you. Now you're just opening up these files and you see if it's a good lead or not. And it helps you analyze them a lot Yeah, faster. the frustration is there because we know it's not just your business that you're working on throughout the day. you got, you know, your job. Sometimes there's stressors from the job. You've got, you know, school. Some of you guys have kids out there. We know exactly how that can be, especially if they are newborns and things like that. So it's just, you know, you just get frustrated because you've got like all of this weight on your shoulders. And at the end of the day, you really just need some help. Yeah. And the goal is now take those responsibilities and, you know, hire Pat Live so they can mm -hmm. answer your calls, get the CRM so that all of the lead and client information is in one place. You don't have to type it in manually. You don't have to answer the calls. You don't have to do any of that. And even hiring a salesperson that can schedule your inspections, that can follow up on these so that they doesn't fall through the cracks. I know for mm -hmm. at least six months, when we first started mm -hmm. our business, we didn't do any follow-up calls mm -hmm. because we were just so focused on answering the phone. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so we had no time to sit down and figure out who we need to follow up with and who we don't. So that's a, and that's when our business really took off is when we could actually have the capacity to follow up. Yeah, I think one of the best feelings when we got our team going, everybody was rocking. We would see these leads coming through and we would both know when it was a hot lead. We didn't even really need to talk to each other, but we know that our team was going to handle it and what was really cool was when we saw these hot leads, we were able to take these leads down and sometimes minutes versus hours or days because we were so organized or just simply trying to play catch up. And that means that your client is really getting screwed. They're getting the what's left energy of you. Mm -hmm. We need to t uh, turn the tables around and we, we need to give them that best energy, that CEO energy. Again, we want to kind of like blow their minds off like, wow. This is extremely fast. This is ex extremely efficient. There's no choice of uh, me working with you versus your competitor. I'm definitely working with you guys because up to this point, before you guys even came to my home and inspected the home, mm -hmm. your level of service is bar none. I've never seen this type of service before. That's what type of impact you want to make on your clients before you even walk in the door. Absolutely. Absolutely. So if you are in our accelerator program, make sure you watch module three. This is the meat and potatoes of scale your sales. We mm -hmm. want to show you the systems and the processes and how we show you behind the scenes, our actual pipelines, our actual call rail mm -hmm. system, and then the whole disposition process mm -hmm. as well. All of the systems and processes we use for that. So make sure you tune into that. Don't try to build it all in it one night. And trust me, Rome wasn't built in a day. <laughs> it takes time. You have to give yourself a little time and space to create it and figure out what works for your business. But just being able to see our systems, I'm sure you're going to get a lot of ideas and you're going to be able to um, digest that and really turn it into something beautiful for your own business. But uh, again, guys, we are so happy and grateful to you guys locked in with us. We hope you got value out of this video. If you did get value, you know what I'm going to say. Hit that like button for us. If you're new to the TCA family, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. And we're so excited to be back 
next week with another powerful video video for you guys to skyrocket your business right. for. And we're also going to link the videos from the past two modules that we've already released here on YouTube so you guys can get a sneak peek of what those sections look like in the Scale Your Sales program. So thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll catch you on the next one.